the, 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 the only real culture shock I've had uh, being Jewish is that um, when I, I went to Chapel Hill in 1967, and um, I went out with a, the first date I had there, the girl said, um, you know, I've never met a Jewish man before. There were no Jews in, in, my, uh, in, my, in my town. And that was a bit of a shock, and it was also like, <laughs> um, there was a certain amount of evil that I felt at that point, too. Because, you know, you went, oh boy. <laughs> um, that was really, I really didn't want, I, I really stopped from sharing that. That would have been funny if I went further, but I thought, I can't go on. Um, and that was kind of amazing, because I was meeting people who weren't, uh, uh, this is not Jewish culture shock, but I went, uh, the first thing I did is I went to see, the, the, we, we had, uh, uh, there were four uh, rooms in like a quad area and a bathroom we shared, and I went next door to meet my, uh, one of the quad mates, and uh, he had the door to his uh, closet open, and he had 24 pairs of shoes. And that really, I, I had two. And I'd never thought, I just was like, that was a stunning moment that people, what would you, I thought, how many days are there in a month? <laughs> and then I joined a fraternity for a, a bit of time, and uh, um, in order that I could get women into a confined space. And, uh, and the, uh, uh, our fraternity was a non-sectarian fraternity, it was a real mix. And uh, we were outside one day, and there was a group across the, the fraternity court from us uh, who were real r redneck uh, Southern fraternity. And it was like 2.30 or 3 in the morning, and we, they, we, were, we were kind of drunk, and they were kind of drunk, and they were screaming at us, uh, you, know, uh, you know, Jew boy. And it was the first and only time in my life I heard the word kike. They were calling us kikes. And uh, I kept saying, uh, I'm the only kike here. Because uh, the rest of them, I said, these are, these are Catholics. They're like, what do you call them? Fish boys or some shit? But that was the only time, and that was it. It never happened after that. That was really it. And then uh, that was the only, uh, that and when I was mildly, I was, I was dropped off, and this is not, this is, yeah, I'm, I'm, I've been dropped off. I'm hitchhiking back to Chapel Hill. I was dropped off by a friend. Um, he's driving this way, uh, trying to think of how it worked. But he's driving. I get out. I start hitchhiking. Um, and neither of us noticed, which is ridiculous. But I'm standing in front of uh, a sign, and I forget the name of the city. And uh, the sign had a giant Klansman on a white horse, all white. Uh, and it said, this is, this is whatever city, home of the Carolina clan. And there's the Jewish guy right in front of me. 